Hey, Soul Fam, what's up? It's your girl, No Goddess. How's everyone doing today? All right, you guys, so I was just pulling some cards here, and let me tell you what's on the board. I already called in my protective angel, guardians, um, ancestors who's ordained. So we're going to just get this right off the top, okay? I'm just going to try to keep this at 10 minutes, all right? First card I got was hard to read. You confuse me. You give me mixed signals, right? And for those reasons, you decide to walk away from this person. You see how you put your hand up? You see that? You're done. You're tired of trying to guess what this person is thinking, guess what's on my mind. You're not a mind reader. You're tired of that Knight of Wands energy, that in and out energy, that unpredictable energy. So this person has one foot in, one foot out. But it says right here, you see how they stress? It says unsent messages. I've written you several texts, but in the end, I chicken out. Okay, because this person wants to come in and play games and they know you're not about it anymore. I feel like y'all, some of y'all got that king of swords, queen of swords energy going. You, you set boundaries with this person. You shut them down. But now this person's letting you know they're shutting it down. I'm swearing off dating. I have no desire to be with anyone. Or maybe this is what you're telling this person. Like, nah. Right now I'm focused on me. I'm working on what I need to work on. Or this person is saying that they're shutting everybody out. They don't want to be with anyone because nobody really satisfied this person, okay? Reconciliation. I'm working up the courage to ask you out on a date. So this person is planning on reconciling with you. So this person could be, when I hear working up the courage, this could be a, a fire sign. Okay, it could be a um, Aries, Leo, or Sag, but they're coming in with an apology. It says right here, I'm sorry for disappointing you. Will you accept my apologies? My collective, are you willing to accept this person's apologies? It says telepathic. I close my eyes and speak to you in a hundred, in a hundred silent ways. So you might be hearing songs or you might just um, happen to walk by, see something on a billboard or reminisce on a place that you guys used to be or used to go out together. But they let you know that you are their true love. And I really do feel like you truly love this person, but you're not willing to put up with the bullshit. You're not willing to play the games that they want to play. You're not going to allow this person to be hopscotching all over your energy. No, nah, you're not going to be playing hopscotch one foot in or two foot in. No, we ain't doing all that so you decide to end that okay you could be a scorpio or you are they're the scorpio but you realize this person they're not giving you what your heart desires so we're going to end that death card we're done i'm done i told you with the three of cups energy this person is coming in to reconcile like they said here it is this person want to heal some issues from the past with you they go to reconciliation three of cups card okay yeah they're swearing off dating if some of them had you in a third party situation that's why this person was in and out because they wasn't really sure who they really wanted to be with but you wasn't going to be one of your options nah baby two of cups nah they had you in a third party relationship yeah they did they were the three of cups with the two of cups and now with the total of five cups they regret that they regret cho choosing this third party or whatever this three this three of cups is this person could have had a life where they really didn't know what they want they was very immature they was all about hanging out with their friends partying clubbing drinking not really laying any foundations for the future and you're not about that you feel me you're not about that you want something that's long term and stable you know what i'm saying for some it's other women other men all right yeah you decide to turn your back on that and focus on your future and your expansion and that's what you want to do you feel me could be dealing with an aquarius or you are the aquarius all right yeah you're too busy focusing on your future plans all right what else is going on but this person definitely want to come in because with the nine of swords they're stressed out this person is having sleepless nights they're wondering what you're doing who you're doing where you're going you know what i'm saying i feel like you completely isolated yourself from this person that's why they telepathically talk to you through songs i feel like some of y'all is i'm hearing strumming my pain with his fingers so you know if this is your first time joining me Welcome. Don't forget to like, share, and subscribe on my YouTube channel at Unknown Goddess. I do I also have TikTok and I also have um Instagram, okay, in case you guys don't have one of the other platforms. All right. Yeah, this person is letting you know nine of swords, they think about you so much. Every every little thing I do, you're on my mind. The way I feel about you. Yeah, this person is gonna come rushing in eight of wands energy. That this person is coming in to profess their love. They want to profess their love, all right? They ready, they're, they're willing to share because I feel like with the Six of Pentacles energy, you left this person out in the cold. You're like, yeah, they wanted to breadcrumb you and now they're feeling like a peasant. They're the one that's feeling like a peasant, okay? Yeah, they're feeling isolated and I feel like you're the one that's isolating your energy with the, from this person. Hermit energy could be dealing with a Virgo. 
Okay, like I said, I did say fire sign here and I see water sign here, but this person is really confused. I mean, this person is like, they were confused for whatever reasons, okay? And they regret it. They are in a lot of regrets. Like I said, we have the three of cups and the two of cups totaling to five cups and 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 they regret it. This person's feeling loud, lost and sad. They don't even know where to begin. It's like they don't even know where to see the light because you are this person's light. You are this person's real true soulmate. All right. They do have a real true soul connection with you, but they was playing. They was playing. Um, everybody plays the fool. All right. So with the hermit energy here, I feel like you have isolated yourself. You're protecting your energy from this person. But this person had to go within and do some real soul searching, some self introspection. And they have to do a lot of healing. OK, they have to do some healing. They have to go through this transformation. They have to let go of the old and, and rebirth themselves. OK, when I see the death card here and that's what they're doing because they're stressed out. They, they realize that you are their true love, the two of cups energy. Uh, this person is ready to come back as this emperor energy or this person uh, could have felt as if they had a dominance over you. They feel like they could have just they would always have control of how you felt about them, that you was going to always, you know, look at them as this wise one and or would or they realizing now that they should have made a wiser decision with the emperor energy here okay so they want to come back as this emperor remember gender is fluent all right so they want to let you know that they're matured but they're obsessing over you with the capricorn energy here okay this person is obsessing over you i feel like whatever relationships they got in they got in they let their best of their addictions to get to them and they're feeling bound this person's feeling bound they probably got into a karmic relationship here and realizing that this karmic will never ever replace you okay mm -hmm. they've been juggling they've been juggling and fighting their addictions like i said for some of them it's just partying drinking uh just living this lifestyle that was just not um just there was no solid foundation there's no future plans you know it doesn't always have to be a, another person it could just be a whole entire situation their addictions and they didn't know this person is somebody who doesn't have their priorities together you know what i'm saying and they rather have their addictions feed their addictions than to prioritize the things that they need in their life and you weren't having it my collective you're like no nah, i need something that we can focus on i need a, a long-term future plans here i need something that we can expand on and grow on and so you decide to prioritize your own so if you you with the two of pentacles energy i could do that i could do on my own you know what i'm saying i could do this all on my own i don't need you around six seven eight pentacles total on the board here yeah this person know that you are very loving kind and nurturing look at that eight pentacles all together on the board leading to the ace of pentacles yeah you're stable you're stable uh, you're you're creating the, the money opportunities that you want in your life, but this person now wants to come back and offer you something stable. And they know that with you, they will have a successful life. They will have a successful life, but they want to share that with you. The Six of Pentacles, they want you to share this life with them. They don't want to do it alone. So I feel like this person is le learning to conquer their demons, learning to conquer their fears. They're not allowing these addictions to control them anymore. They've gained control over that. And they want to come back and they're launching forward better than ever, baby, better than ever, okay? Yeah, they want you to know, yes, because you are this person's better half. There it is. This person's coming in to offer you marriage. All right, Three of Pentacles. They're willing to put in that hard work. They're willing to put in the hard work for you to... um recognize them for it okay they're going to emperor and the empress there it is they ready to come in they want to team up collaborate build with you share with you and give you the stable life they want to be that main man that main woman they want to be your husband or your wife all right yeah so it's up to you my collective but this is what they come back as and they're letting you know that they're no longer in this energy of because they have to they, they search long and hard they're realizing that there is nothing else out there that, that you complete them you're their end all be all but this person has to come as a whole before you take them back and so with that soul searching this person is going within and getting spiritual guidance and they're going through that transformation they're going through the death of the ego all right they're letting go of all the things they letting go of the third parties they're letting go of the so-called friends and uh you know people who were just reckless and people who fed their addictions whether it's sexual drugs alcohol whatever it was but this person is totally obsessed with you they they they, they feel like they can't let you go right they feel like they can't let you go, but they're ready. They're ready to reconcile with you, and they're they're getting they're gaining their strength. They're definitely coming forward and launching forward to come and make that happen with you. All right, yeah. They want to let you know that it's okay. They're secure. Okay, did not tell you they was in this Knight of Wands energy, but you make this person feel so vulnerable. You know what I'm saying? Being around you, you make this person so vulnerable. It's like they're at a restless state. They're ready to come back and prove themselves to you. All right, yeah. They're ready to pour out all their emotions and they're ready to take that risk and they're hoping that you take this leap with them.
All right, my collective, they're ready to take this up. It says, everybody plays a fool sometimes. All right? Yeah, this person realized with the Eight of Swords energy, they have to let go of that victim mentality. You aren't here to hurt them, but only to love them and make them better. All right? But they have to find that better within themselves. And that's what they're willing to let you know that they're here to do. All right, my collective? So, yeah, Nine of Wands. Been through the ringer. And they're done with it. They're ready to rest and heal. I wish you all love and light, okay? Bye.